I'm Jill Austin. I'm a United Way board member, and I'm also the vice chair of the Community Impact Committee. We're going to be very busy during this next month at the United Way of Rutherford and Cannon Counties. Uh, the Community Impact Committee has been working since September on organizing our uh, plan for uh, funding for this next year. And we will have 75 volunteers in the United Way offices during the next month. Uh, we will also have uh, representatives for more than 30 United Way agencies in. Uh, we've divided these discussions into panel, uh, panel groups, and these panel groups will consist of six to eight different agencies. Uh, we will spend a full day uh, with these different five panels, uh, listening to what the agencies need, what they do, uh, what their wish lists, lists are, and then we will also ask lots of questions and get lots of answers. Uh, after that point, then the committee members on the panel uh, will talk about uh, what they heard that day and they will make recommendations for funding. After all of those panels have met, funding decisions have been recommended by each of the panels, that information then comes to the committee uh, that I'm on, the Community Impact Committee. Uh, we will evaluate all of that information and then we will make a recommendation to the board. And then the board will finally make a determination of uh, what the funding will be uh, for that year based on uh, the money that has been contributed. Uh, we always have a difficult time with this because there are always more wishes and more needs uh, than there is money to provide. Uh, so it's a very difficult decision on the part of the panel members uh, to make those recommendations. Uh, we always can use more volunteers and so uh, we would be happy for people to contact the United Way uh, and volunteer to serve on a panel, uh, volunteer to help with this process. That would be very, very helpful to us. Thank you.